Hello everyone, welcome to today's video. In for a detail, we have a 2012 Audi A1, which has not been washed in a long time and has a good amount of dirt caked on on the outside. Moving to the interior, it's full of dirt, dog hair and dog slobber all over. Starting with the wheels, I'll use the pressure washer to get most of the brake dust and the grime sprayed right off. With wheels this dirty, I'm spraying some APC on the wheels and the tires before agitating. For the wheel face, I like to use a wash mitt as it allows me to get into the hard to reach faces. Now it's time for the pre-wash rinse to get all the loose dirt removed. After the rinse, I will cover the car in a blanket of foam and go around with my detailing brush to hit all the crevices where my washer metal can't reach.
drying, I will spray some turtle wax seal and shine on the car to add a layer of protection as well as prevent water spots. Moving to the interior that is covered in dirt and the seats is covered in dog air. Starting with the rubber floor mats, spraying them down to the press rusher and giving them a good scrub with some APC. Next I'll go around the interior with my vacuum cleaner to get all the dirt and dog air sucked up. For the interior plastics, I'll use some Turtle Wax Fresh Clean spread in a damp microfiber towel to wipe them down. Finishing off the plastics, I'll apply some Meguiar's Natural Shine to have them looking new again as well as adding a layer of protection. For the carpeted floor mats, I'll use a window squeegee to loosen the dog hair from the fibers and suck them up with the vacuum.
cleaning the windows, I'll spray window cleaner on a waffle weave towel, flipping the towel to buff off and leave a streak free finish. Lastly, I'll apply Turtle Wax Black in a flash to the tires using my curved tire dressing sponges. Five hours later, this little Audi is looking great again. Thanks for watching, if you liked the video please leave me a like and I'll see you for the next detail.